from our board standpoint, uh, what council approved today wasn't the our board's preferred option, but it's the purview of council to uh, determine how money is spent in the city, and council did that. So uh, the good news is that we're going to continue, and we'll try to improve the program and look to other ways to fund it moving forward. Every level of government, I guess, has uh, lots of people coming to them for requests and wishes, and just like the city, the province has uh, priorities and things that they need to do in terms of uh, spending money and. Uh, I think we're aware of what the provincial finance is like right now too. So I think it's a fair ask because uh, certainly the purview of some of the social issues uh, does fall into uh, provincial responsibility. So I think that's fair whether or not they'll be met with success. I guess uh, we won't know unless the ask is made. I think the recommendations before the committee today were very sound and uh, we'll certainly uh, work closer again as we have in the past couple of years with the CSOs. I mean, we're both trying to achieve the same uh, uh, outcome and that's to get people uh, some help that are living on the streets if they're not downtown and they have a safe place to be. Well, it fills a gap of uh, people that are su suffering from substance abuse, uh, mental health issues that are living on the streets of Saskatoon. It's a conduit uh, for the uh, CSOs to uh, reach out, actually take them by hand to get some help that they need.